quick start armature display options, let's have a look in the properties editor. An armature does have quite a few properties. One important is the display option. Display. Here it is. And it's about this row here. Here you can define how your armature is displayed. But before we have a look at the different display methods, let's explore another important setting that is called X-Ray. When you create a primitive, let's go into object mode for a moment and let's create a cube, then you can see that the cube covers the skeleton. When you choose X-Ray here, then the skeleton display is above the mesh. Now for the modes. Octahedral is the default method. It displays a bone with a big end and a small end. Here you have the head joint and here you have the tail joint. The method stick displays the mesh as sticks. The method bbones is a special display mode. It does not only change the display, but it also activates bendy bones. The bendy bones setting can be found in the bone tab in the bendy bones panel. Bendy bones um, divides the bone. And does quite a few other tricks. But bendy bones is a bit too complex to be explained here. Let's go on with the modes. Envelope is displays the influence area of the bone. This is of interest when you attach a mesh to the bones. This area here is where the mesh gets calculated then. You can adjust the envelope here in the transform panel. And finally the last mode is wire. It displays the joints and the rest as thin lines. In pose mode there is another way to display the bones. Here you can display bones in custom shape. This can basically be every object in the scene. Let's use this cube here. Move it a bit of sides. Let's select our bone again and choose cube. And as you can see, the bone displays as a cube now. Can be found here in bone tab and in display panel.